We continued on from Milwaukee further north until we crossed into Michigan, with a brief stop in the middle of nowhere for a delicious ice cream. In St. Ignatius, I saw a ferret or a weasel or something like that, which I felt was necessary to record as I'd never seen one in the wild before. We then boarded a ferry to a little spot of land in Lake Michigan called Mackinac Island. It's spelled with a C at the end, but everyone pronounces it Mackinac, so that's what I did too. This is the place my Aunt Kathleen grew up visiting, and so it was really special for her to be the one to show me around. Mackinac Island is the kind of place that seems unreal. I kept saying that I felt like I was in Disney World. There are no cars, so people get around on foot, bicycle, or horse. We stayed in the cutest little inn with beautiful gardens and delicious breakfasts and treats. I must have eaten my weight in locally made fudge. We spent most of our time exploring the island, going out to eat in really lovely restaurants, and we even played a little mini golf. I could go on about everything I did in Mackinac, but I'd rather give you a taste of what it feels like to be there. It's beautiful and peaceful, even though it was peak tourist season. The lake is gorgeous and everything is made with the intention of aesthetic, which I can absolutely respect. So I present to you Mackinac Island. Last day on the island, trying to enjoy the solitude.